Hey guys, today I'm going to take you through my wash day routine. Unfortunately, I have already done the majority. Um, I've already shampooed and deep conditioned my hair. Um, right now I'm at the detangling process. I've already moisturized and sealed, but I will explain to you what I've done. Okay, first I wash, first I pre poo my hair. And what I do is I take this oil here, and it is the Vatica um, cactus, cactus and garlic oil, and it's supposed to stop hair fall. Um, I absolutely love this oil right now. And Amazon actually jacked the price up to like $15, but it's retailed at $4 in your local Indian store. So I'm going to have to see if my city has an Indian store and find it. But what I do is I take this pipette here, and I stick it in the oil, I suck some up, and I put it through my hair, squeezing like this. And it works as, you know, um, as a nozzle or whatever. And that's what I do, and I put it all over my hair, and I cover it with saran wrap or shower cap, and I let that sit for about 30 minutes. I then shampooed my hair, and I actually got a new shampoo, um, and I'm not sure how I feel about it yet. It was a little cheapy shampoo, and it does have sulfate. Um, just a second, let me get it. Is this Africa's Best? shampoo with conditioner. Now like I said it does have sulfates in it but I pre poo before and I also um, do a moisturizing deep condition as well so I should be okay with that. Um, after I shampooed my hair I got out of the shower and I deep conditioned with my Canachome at Silicone Mix this time which is this right here and Sorry guys, the silicone mix right here. Am I in the shot? Yeah, I'm in the shot. The silicone mix there, uh, which is a protein deep condition. And um, I put the ram wrap on again, and um, I covered my hair with a skull cap, um, the saran wrap, then a skull cap um, to lock the heat in. And I sat like that for an hour with the protein deep conditioner on. I got back into the shower, I rinsed that out, and then I put this enriched coconut oil on my hair, throughout my hair on my scalp, covered it with a uh, saran wrap again and the skull cap again, and um, moisturizer deep conditioned for an hour. Okay, so after I let that sit on for an hour with the heat locked in, I got back into the shower, and then I um, conditioned a rinse with Hello Hydrations, uh, Herbal Essence Hello Hydrations Conditioner. You know, I didn't deep condition or anything. I just put that on, let it run throughout my hair to get the majority of the oil out. Okay, after I did that, um, I put my towel on my hair and let it soak up the majority of the water and then I got this leave-in conditioner I'm trying this this is the Red Ken Fifth Avenue extreme anti snap I'm gonna try this to see if it can help combat the breakage that I've been having I'm not exactly sure if I need protein because I have not switched to a seamless comb yeah you know bad for me I haven't switched to a seamless comb, so I'm thinking that it could be the comb. Um, I read somewhere where the seam can, the seam in the comb while you're combing it can actually slice your strands and, uh, you know, cause breakage that way and, and the hair strand will eventually become so weak and separated that it pops off. So it could be this comb because this is the comb that I use and you can see here if you can see that that it does have a seam so this comb is not seamless so I probably need to invest in a seamless comb but anyway um, I put this the anti-snap as my leave-in conditioner then I grabbed my trusty cactus oil again and I oiled my scalp with the pipette not using much this time you know just a few parts massage the oil onto my scalp and 
I put on my trusty olive oil ORS on top of um, the red can. This is an extra moisturizing, you know, what do you call it, to balance out the protein moisture there. So now this is where I am. I'm in the detangling process. My hair is probably about 65% dry. So I'm just going to lightly detangle my hair. Um, I'm debating on if I want to flat iron my hair. I'm not exactly sure if I want to flat iron being that I'm using a new product, the anti-snap. I'm going to have to uh, do a bit of research and see if ladies are flat ironing after they use that treatment. Um, you know, I just don't feel too comfortable yet um, doing a, a heat application <laughs> as harsh as a flat iron <clears throat> on top of that protein treatment right now, which is it's probably okay being that it's a leave-in conditioner. but. I just don't feel comfortable doing it. So I'm going to blow dry, I know for sure. And uh, then I'll come back to you guys after my hair is blown dry. <clears throat> now I will say, I watched a couple ladies on YouTube um, detangle their hair. I use a combination of my fingers and the comb. Um, and I don't use the wide tooth comb either, guys. Um, you know, I just try to be extra careful with this medium tooth comb. Now, let me show you the hair that I have when I'm done detangling. This is my hair lost just with the detangling process. Now, most of the time, it's quite a bit more than this, so something has been working, and I'm pretty sure it's the Vatica oil. But I used to be so terrified. Um, detangling my hair. I would have tons, tons of hair in the comb, but <laughs> the ladies that I see detangle their hair, they're like, oh, this is all that I had. And it's one strand or two strands of hair. And I'm like, what planet are y'all living on? And y'all need to tell me what y'all using because I have a lot more hair um, fall out than that. Or a lot more hair in the comb. <clears throat> Excuse me, when I'm through detangling. But I'm going to blow dry, guys, and I'll come back to you after I'm done blow drying. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to flat iron yet. Uh, it's been a month since my last flat iron, so I could flat iron and do a link check, or I could wait until the end of April um, for my relaxer and my link check. I don't know, but you guys will know um, at the end of this video what I decide to do. Thanks. Okay guys, so here is a picture of my hair blow dried and I did decide to flat iron and when I flat iron my hair, I put it into four sections as you see here. And here's just a front shot of those four sections. And this is the end result of my flat iron. As you can see, it is grazing the top of my bra strap. And actually, my hair, when I do not use the Ancient Secrets oil, my hair only grows a smidgen of an inch. Here's a side shot. So, I don't think my hair has grown even a half of an inch since I stopped using the Ancient Secrets oil. Here is a picture of my hair in January, my last relaxer. And here's a comparison pic of January and now, which has been over a month ago, and my hair has only grown so little. You cannot convince me that that oil does not work. It works great for me, and I hope it does the same for you guys. Um, as always, thanks for watching, and be blessed. Thanks.